how do we integrate 1 over 1 minus x from 0 to 1? Oh, and let's graph it as well. The first thing to notice is that this is an improper integral because the region of integration contains a discontinuity of the integrand, namely this 1, because this gives us a denominator of 0. So, technically, we should be taking the limit as some b approaches 1 from the left of this integral from 0 to b. If we take a look at the antiderivative, this is the natural log of the denominator, but by the chain rule in reverse, we need to divide by negative 1. So we're taking the limit as b approaches 1 from below of this negative natural log 1 minus x after plugging in the bounds of b and 0. At 0, we get the natural log of 1, which is 0, so we only have the b bound to plug in. We can take the negative sign outside the limit, and now notice if b approaches 1 from below, then the input of the natural log, 1 minus b, will approach 0 from above. 1 minus something, a little bit less than 1, is a tiny positive number, 0 plus. And we know that the natural log tends to negative infinity as its input tends to 0 from above. But we have a negative sign outside as well, so this ends up being positive infinity. So the improper integral we started with diverges to infinity. Now let's take a look at this graphically. We'll start with the basic reciprocal function, y equals 1 over x, which we all know, I hope, looks something like this. To get the integrand from this parent function, we'll start by adding 1 to the denominator, which is graphically a horizontal translation of one unit to the left. So the vertical asymptote is now at x equals negative 1 instead of being the y-axis. And now we need to replace x by negative x, which is effectively a reflection in the y-axis, like this. So the asymptote is at x equals 1 now. The area we're trying to find is the area under this curve from 0 to 1. So it's this area over here. So the question becomes, does the curve approach the asymptote fast enough for the area to converge to a finite number? From the integral, we know that the answer is no.